And we are continuing our coverage at the PDAC. Joining me is the founder of Women Who Rock, Elena Mayer. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. So tell me a bit about uh, Women Who Rock. So it's a new social club, and I guess I shouldn't say social club anymore, okay. because we just uh, changed our strategy and we're creating an organization rather than a social club. It started as such about a year ago, but it turned out to be so much bigger than that. So right now we're in the process of revamping our strategy. Now, what, uh, what brought you to found this? Where did you get the idea to, uh, to get this going? PEDEC 2014. So actually, I went to a Faskins panel, and there were a number of women talking about um, women on boards and the scarcity of women in mining. And Anna Todella, along with Maureen Jensen, were so passionate about mining. And they, they were saying that they are lacking social space for women to meet. And that's what sort of created the idea. So you were a presenter at PDAC yesterday with uh, the Global Mining Management Program offered at the Schulich Business School. Tell us a bit about that. So this is a new program. This is third year they're rolling it out. It was created by uh, former CEO of Inmat, Richard Ross. Uh, he's quite known in the industry and created this MBA. It's unique, one of a kind in the world to give a sort of a overall uh, foundation, academic foundation for mining, something that hasn't uh, existed previously. Uh, now I've got a note here saying that uh, there's an auction within the industry with uh, some big names out there, uh, one of which Pierre Lassonde. Yeah. <laughs> what plans do you have uh, for 2015 then? Well, we are going to have uh, another auction, the yeah. second annual auction. So this idea of auctioning mentorship time um, actually turned out to be pretty successful because what happens that most of the panelists, and it wasn't Pierre Lassonde only, it was David Garofalo and Paul Rawlinson sure. and Rob McEwen, there were 12 of them, and they were supposed to meet with students for one hour of their time. Yeah. Most of them actually agreed and offered to mentor the women on a quarterly basis. So now we have a, a, a new pool of CEOs who are willing to do that. And first time around, it was really difficult. And we're going to have a, another great event that's coming up in May. We're partnering with uh, Brittany Korzynski and her organization, the Canadian Art and Fashion Fund. Right. So she's another incredible woman in mining. Fair enough. Thanks a lot for your time. Thanks for thank joining you. us. And thank you for watching our continued coverage from the PDAC. Have a good one.